Today we are playing Incredibles Havoc. This is the Disasters V2 second version, like the follow-up, I believe. To not make this, you know, just boring, you know, reading the lore, I'm going to be animating on the stories in this one, you know, actually making them cool and stuff. So, you know, it's, it's gonna take a lot of effort, but hopefully it's gonna turn out good. So if you enjoy it, uh, leave a like if you, if you enjoy it the outcome and grab yourself something to drink and something to eat and we get right into this mr mr bam okay 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 so if one two three four one two three four okay the b payment is gonna be like one million so that means that this one is gonna be hella good okay wait i believe this is pilot though Okay, so nice tempo at the beginning. I believe this is Pilot. Uh, we got Peagle. Oh, status alive? Question mark. Unknown stage and class mimic. Okay, so we have stage. I don't know what that's supposed to mean. Class mimic. Okay. A mimic I made to spy on the new camp. He isn't a real person. He's made entirely out of the blackening. God, I love this stuff. Written by a Neister with a fucking three. Wait, is that really a Neister though? Is that... Neister <laughs> three? Okay, so the blackening is back. I remember the black goopy goopy goop. And apparently this one is a product made of that. So now we can create a whole fucking people, basically. Peagle is not even real. That's a shit star for you. But your sound was kind of nice. Going with the boom, 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 boom. And now we're probably going to get the boom, boom, boom. A clatter. Let's see who the fuck is this lad? Is it Seppes maybe? Maybe it's Seppes? Oof, okay. Okay, so high, so high fast percussion. Like, hit hat this. Hit hat this. Suck my patties. What? The it is Sepp. Okay, I'm not entirely out. Okay, my. Okay, so we got the name is Sepp. Uh, status alive. Ooh, stage zero and class scavenger. Oh, that's fucking sick. Look at him. Description. Some idiot looking for materials in the woods. He has some nerve walking out there. I'll see what I can do. He's also the founder of the first camp that came to my attention. Written by fucking... I'll see what I can do. What do you mean? So Neeser... I'll see... Yeah, well, if you remember, Nice was an absolute maniac in the first one. Holy shit, he killed everyone. My ass is diabolical, bro. So I guess that he wants to kind of, you know... Woo, woo. I said it once again, you know, fucking join them away. The first camp that came to my attention. There, there, there might be more camps. Uh, that's something that we're gonna have in mind. Yeah, what a surprise. Yeah, Sepp out here scavenging all night. He's not gonna stay alive because Nice is gonna chop him alive. Okay. Let's see the Mr. Thor, lad. What you gotta... Hey, yeah. Uh, oh, yeah. What the f- Who the fuck is this guy? What? So, okay, so we got someone in the Kudibos channel again looking like this. Uh, I just wanna see one thing right here. I just wanna see one thing right here. Oh, okay. Oof. <laughs> okay. Surname, Ace of Spades. Status alive. Uh, stage unknown and class mimic fail. Oh, Jesus Lord. Okay. Makes sense that this guy failed. Look, look at the fucking state of him. Okay. Description. Oh, yeah. This hunk of trash. I tried to make a master out of the blackening. Like JT. But I failed. It really sucks because I can't kill this one. So JT, uh, if I remember, JT in the last uh, disaster one killed everyone. But didn't JT like die last time? I think he like low-key died. Uh, okay, and now you can't kill this one. Why can't you kill this one? Is it because he's too powerful, maybe? Maybe he made it too strong? Maybe you can't hold back? Nisar, uh, why is Nisar even the main guy? Nisar is gonna, yeah, yeah, so like, uh, Nisar seems like a good guy. But Nisar seems that he's too, way too impulsive to be the leader of this entire shit. Look at what's happening. He tried to make a class mimic. Oh shit, well, now he's gonna kill me back. Put Acerus. As a, as a leader of this. I feel like he will go in and be like, let's actually strategize this one, guys. Not this, the need is gonna go absolute ape shit again. Uh, let's keep going with the fourth beat. Yeah. TV time. Hey. Orange guy. Ooh, yeah. What this, who the fuck in this community is a TV? Tobe. Who the fuck is Tobe? Oh, my bad. If I, if I, if I, if, if, if this is obvious and I, I, I mess it up, I, my bad. Uh, status alive, stage zero, and class machinery. Description. A robot Vincent created for his factory back in Spiral Down. When he made that portal, he chose to bring Tobe with him for protection or whatever. He doesn't seem too dangerous. Written by... Uh, <laughs> Tobe, I feel like he, you, you put him as an NPC. This is a side character. Th this guy doesn't really do anything. Maybe he's gonna go, go, come back later, but who knows. But for now, let's continue with the last last beat uh, let's see what the fuck oh. oh okay let me tell you something this might be bad fuck shit Woo. 
Ah ouais, voilà, c'est là, il te regarde. Et, et, oh, 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 ok. Do I blur that? Uh, like the whole spine was like kind of exposed. This is really pushing the pushing, uh, pushing the farm. What did you do to my brother Crimson? Like, the legs are gone. Oh, well, damn, look at this shadow. So, uh, we got Crimson. Don't really know what Crimson is, but I do now. Uh, thank you, Crimson. Uh, I love you. Uh, I don't yet. Uh, maybe, what? <laughs> okay, maybe our fun. Status dead, stage zero, and class victim. So, we got a lot of victims here. Now, wait. Uh, description. There's nothing more than a warning sign now. Jesus Christ. Written by Sepp. Okay, this makes me believe that Sepp and Denista uh, got some shit going on. If this guy, is a, he died as a victim. And if he's dead as a victim, it means that you have suffered a fate. Someone has like, killed you, you know? First, why would, why would Sepp say Jesus Christ if he's the one that killed him? So maybe Sepp has like found all this shit after. Nisa is like a badass boy. He just kills everyone. Maybe Sepp is on the cleanup crew like fuck. Because he's a scavenger. He's a scavenger. So he found him by, in the woods. Just like Logan Paul once again. Okay, this guy. Maybe we're gonna get some extra explanation of this because holy shit that's all uh, holy shit that's all uh, we got uh, so far see what we can kind of make pop and now we're gonna see if we're gonna get the tempo or if this is gonna be bedtime lullaby oh uh. oof 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 we're kind of waiting we're kind of just standing back like shit okay what's going on i don't know what's going on hey do you know asap you know what's going on oh, you don't know you know what we're gonna see what's up now okay you wanna see what also, uh, at the end, uh, we're gonna go uh, to some secret stuff here. After the end of the video, we're gonna uh, pull up some secret stuff. <laughs> so don't miss that. Okay, let's go into FX. Who is this guy? I recognize this. What the fuck? Do you get some saw contraption here? Oh yeah, tell me something, boy. Okay. A little bit of orange eye. Okay. Oh, this is dramatic. Wait. And what put the other thing we can do? Oh, wait. Oh, wait. Okay. Okay. Oh. Okay. You ready to grave? Oh. Woof. This is Vincent. Okay, now we got Vincent. Look at this fucking badass. Fucking underman. Yeah. Fucking dope ass looking shit. Vincent created this guy, okay? The, the, the robot guy. That's what we gotta remember. He's a scientist, okay? Stage zero. Description. Damn it. I should have been more cautious. I didn't know what that stuff would do. God. I'll try my best to help the camp members out, but I don't think I can do much. Written by Vincent. It's, it's, so it's just predictable. You know, you have this guy. Oh, I'm gonna fucking cook something up. What happens? Fucking Nyanjela comes at you with the fucking dark magical powers. Of course, you're gonna fuck up. So what did he do though? He did some shit in the in the science lab that made the entire camp fucking lose their shit. I think. Damn, that's so sick as I'm kind of lord though. You know, I like you very much. I like you very much, Vincent. Okay, let's see. Next guy. Oh, I recognize this. Oh, look, what, what, why, why, this cool kind of melody, you know? Okay, wait, we gotta, we gotta try with the bass, we gotta try with the bass. Oh, we got Aussie, okay, now I remember Aussie, I remember Aussie, like Aussie box, Aussie box. Status alive, stage zero, and survivor. <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> well, I mean this. Okay, let's go. Okay, let's go. Okay, so <clears throat> description. <sighs> I'm worried for the guy. He said he was gonna go look for his husband a while ago. We haven't seen him since. Before he left, uh, it was something about how his hubby wasn't responding to his calls or whatever. I hope he doesn't have to face. Redacted himself. Written by Podeman. Yep, that's me. That's me. I'm here. <laughs> So something is out there. Something is out there. Why the fuck am I writing this? I don't know, but something is out there. That's kind of scary to know. Uh, we're gonna see the fourth, uh, no, the third uh, effect now. Hope I hope also gets back to life, honestly. Is this Hopi? Or what the fuck is this? It's like a banner. Oh, I don't like this. I don't like the fact that this fucking shit that I'm looking at has the eyes ripped out and it's this sound. Jaha, what the fuck? No, this is Hazel. I'm totally wrong. Okay. Infected. Stage 2. Class infected. So I have status infected and class infected. Excuse me, silver rubber fucker. Okay, sorry. Okay. Description. He went out into the woods to look for tools. Lucky him. He found them. JT put them in his face. <laughs> What? <laughs> Lovely. He went into the woods to look for tools. Like him, he found them. Then JT just fucking came back. Okay, so JT is still a menace. God damn, hope you gotta change half of this ain't work. 
Look, I found two. JT comes fucking just joint. Your eyes is gone. Do you see how red I am for fucking fishing? And uh, now we have the fourth mm, effect. Oh, what is this kind of shit? Wait, 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 wait. Oh, what do we get? A little bit of Jamaica vibe. Hey. Why is this page fucked? Now we get the Gister. Age 18. Height 5.9. <laughs> yeah, boys. A little bit more. Eye color heterochromia. What, what the fuck is that? Blood type A flat. And hair color. <laughs> musicians will get that joke. Hair color uh, black. Okay. I don't think we can animate this because this is totally out of. This is a change. Let's just read this for what it is, okay? Hi, this is Lama. I found him. I might uh, go with him into the woods to see what's up. I got Sib to check out his face. Why are you gonna go with him with the woods? Uh, that's a bit like Jeffrey Dahmer type style. If you know what this means, it, it is also get explained later. I want you to explain what this means because this looks chic. But now we're gonna go into the effect five, okay? Are you ready? Oh. This is the king of all the kings. This is the queen of all the queens. I wanna tell you something right now. Okay, so, so, we are Jamaica today. We're playing Incredibles. You wanna fit in my face? I wanna take you to no. This is King Comrade. So, a uh, redacted picture. That's a shame. What the fuck? Description. Don't fucking cross me again. Yes. Uh, written by Neister. Neister, uh, don't want you to fucking cross me again. Neister is uh, kind of uh, scary. I'm kind of scared uh, what the fuck my guy is gonna be in this. Like, if am I gonna get killed by fucking Neister? Hopefully not. Bro, Conrad didn't even get the chance to be in this. Conrad comes in and just fucking dies, basically. I don't know. Okay, let's see all the, uh, the effects together and let's see. Oh, baby boy in my toy. I wanna show you what I look inside my little crib, yo. Oh, what the fuck? No, that's a little bit perverse. Now, boys, let's go in to melody this. One by one and see. Yo. Yeah. Who is this? Who is this? <sighs> okay, dude. Oh, look at the cheeky shading as well. Okay, there's some detail into this. Fuck, man, this melody. This sounds like like children. Uh, this sounds like uh, childhood. Now we all just hear the person shoot. Okay, this is pixel. Pixel, pixel. Pixelated. I know pixel. It's just hard to remember sometimes. <laughs> I don't know if with anything. What the fuck? So this is just a fucking mystery. Description. Founder in the woods wandering around. Didn't interact due to Jester showing intense signs of fear. I'll notify Sep to check him out. She has an inconsistent attitude and has acted very strangely in general. She didn't say anything when me and Jester walked past her. Who did this to her? Written by Lama. Okay, so this ju is just like a, maybe a skinwalker. Maybe a skinwalker. You know how you they take on the um, attitude of like a person and just goes out and be like, <laughs> a picture of what? We don't even know if like if she's alive or a human or anything. She's just there. Uh, so we're gonna see if we can find that out. Otherwise, this could be a mystery that we're gonna have to bury with the ashes of the dawn. Ashes of the dawn is calling up on my name. Oh, so we got to me, but first we got this one. Let's see uh, the second melody. What's gonna bring to the table? Oh. This is a game changer. It's like a genre changer. I wanna see how this goes for the first guy. I'll allow me to do that. Oof, okay, now. Now it's not really that, you know, we just kind of standing back and while I'm with it with the beast and effect. Now we're in the middle of the forest. We're looking back like shit. I see you looking at my corner. I see you too. I got people to my left and to my right. Fuck you and fuck you too. You wanna talk to me? You wanna call me son of a little sheep? Don't do that. That's kind of bestiality. Yeah, but that's not me. Oh, it's nightfall. What the fuck? Uh, nightfall, status alive, stage zero, class alive. Description. I'm scared of this one. I don't know how we can really deal with it because it's immune to the blackening. He's the embodiment of the void. Written by Nisar. It's immune to the blackening. So this one isn't the blackening. So this is like the embodiment of the void. Is this a weird blackening come from? Like you, you can't get affected by something you're all part of, you know? 
if we go and touch uh, tribes. Cool ass dude. Uh, I don't really know what to do with this information about now, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> oh, are you ready? Are you ready? Are you ready? Are you ready? Uh, let's see what podium is gonna be. Oh. What? Oh. Oh. The colors are right though. Look at this. Why am I playing with a tortilla chip? Oh, no, I'm mad. Wait, where are the lessons? No, mom. I mean the mom. What? It's here. And let me just tell you, I sound fucking beautiful. Oh, it's like peace all over the earth. Holy shit, I'm sick. <laughs> Damn, bro, I'm, they just throw me in here like if I just look at me go. Oh, oh, that's fucking sick. So, surname is <laughs> Powderman. So, that is alive. Stay zero, class detective. Oh. <laughs> oh, let me tell you, the detective force once again comes to class. Holy shit. Description. Oof. Uh, no, what, what? I hate this bastard. The second camp let him in because they think he's some genius detective who can solve all of their problems. I'm still salty about that this track. No, what fun? <laughs> Come on, Easter. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> that, that's fair. Okay, that's fair. That's fair. I, I hate myself as well. Come on up into uh, the second camp let him in because they think he's a genius detective. Uh, uh, um, excuse me, my class is the detective force. What do you mean? What do you think he's some genius detective? I am the genius detective. Excuse me. I still thought about this district. Right? Oh, you mean this one? Oh, All right, it's Mr. Mr. BP and the mic. Got a bad guy who sits inside his room and I fight in the room. You never responded. Maybe that's for the best because your lyrics were absolutely gonna fucking rip my entire generation of bloodline to pieces. I'm still waiting. <laughs> okay, what's that? Okay, shit. I mean, I'm here. I'm fucking happy that I'm here. I'm a sick ass detective. I'll take that any day of the week. But we, unfortunately, we gotta move on. But you, you just look at me in this mix. I'm a fucking detective. And I'm a melody. You know, that's I'm just here to vibe. You know, I'm just here to vibe. Let's see now. The fourth one. Oh, is this lemon? Hey. Sliced green lemon. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, what is that like? Yeah. Tremolo. Okay, it's Lemmo. I, I, I really don't know what the Lemmo name, but I know the Lemmo. I know Lemmo. I know Lemmo. So now, Lemmo, status alive, stage zero, class survivor. <sighs> I don't, have never seen a Lemmo this fucking sexy before. Ah! Description. I hate this one. He's so fucking annoying when I'm trying to attack the camp, because he can shine light out of that eye of his. It's a lie, JT. So Nisa hates me and JT hates the fucking Lemmo. What do you mean? Lemmo, I trust that you and me can work this out. You know, I can uh, act uh, a detective together. You can just like fucking flashbang them. Uh, so I've, that's a dream team. I hope we're in the same camp. So the, the second camp let him in because they think he's a genius. The first camp didn't even want me there. What the fuck? I'm a second choice. Oh, oh hello. Let's see. Hydration man. Yeah, I, I'm sorry though, but you look kind of uh, possessed by the blackening. Help me, God damn! Uh, Status so infected, stage four, class survivor. So not the black. What? I don't really know. But you have the, you have stage four somewhere, and then you know. Okay. Description. I don't know how the fuck he slipped up, but I found it amusing. He could have done so much, but it was affected quick. What a goddamn waste. I don't know why or how, but the asshole has since been taking bodies to wherever he resides. I appreciate him covering up my tracks, but I got no damn clue what he's doing to him. Written by. Could have done so much, but he was affected quick. Okay, so you were like a fucking champ, but then you get affected because you carried all the dead bodies, I suppose. Uh, but why did this little part here? I appreciate him covering up my tracks. That means that Nisa is just killing everyone, and this guy is just like his fucking slave and going out and just like, yo, you're coming with me. And now we get into the voices. Now this is gonna wrap everything together. We're gonna first see though the melodies together. You know, that's what we do. I must say it's beautifully composed because you have that kind of shit. We're about to fucking fight and like we already have kind of fought, you know? You have all that together. Uh, the voices, are you ready? The first voice. What the fuck is this to say? Full screen. This design is so fucking sick. I will tattoo it. I could literally tattoo this into my arm and be like, fuck you. Like that's, oh, that looks sick. Slurics. Very nice. You gotta 
and tell me what that guy sings because I can't actually hear what he sings. But fuck, that design was kind of like. Oh, let's go. Who the fuck is let's go? Okay, but I don't know. Status alive. Stage zero. Class. Combatant. Yeah, combatant. What a person. Okay. Description. The founder of the second camp that came to my attention. He's a skilled combatant, so he's a bit of a scare. I'll send Shimura to deal with him. Uh, Shimura? Who the fuck is Shimura? Okay, but this is the founder of the second camp. So this is the camp that took me in. I'm working with this guy. What the fuck? That's sick. Okay, so Shimura uh, is supposed to go deal with him. I guess that's gonna be like the final boss. Maybe we are setting up for a disaster V3. Uh, but holy fucking shit, that's kind of fucking dope. Okay, now we're gonna see. I saw the person. Brazil, now we're gonna see. What can you do? Running faster every day. Is this you know everything will never be the same oh. You know that solidarity is the only way yeah. You wanna let yourself be a part of their game What the fuck? That's insane. Like, person from Brazil. Like, I guess that you singing. Your voice is so fucking incredible. So. Like, you, you are all incredible. The so epitome of incredible. Absolutely beautiful. A yeah, person from Brazil. Alive. Stage zero. Class. Survivor. Description. Just some guy in the second camp. Oh, that means that I'm, I'm there with them. Like, I'm part of the cool guys. Um, Just some guy in the second camp. The radiation melted his shoulders so his arms don't move right. I would say, though. He has a pretty nice singing voice. You're a survivor. Fuck, you sick. This is just absolutely sick. And Nisir is writing this as well. I don't know why Nisir is writing all of this. It's like he has some gold power that knows stuff that we don't know. But, I mean, I guess we gotta see. No sound for the great man. I believe this is ultimate. And I believe he's singing. I believe this might sound good. Right, run, run away, but I always stay in the fuck you Arte coming with the focus and the fucking one night. Shimura. 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 So Shimura is the guy that was sent out to kill a lot of people, basically. Fail mimic. Okay, so it's a fucking fail mimic of Artem. Description. A fake clone I made of Harlemy. He's a fucking menace. Terrifying. Almost immediately after his creation. He ran off into the woods and then came back with half of someone's face, along with pieces of blue clothing. Obviously belonging to the unlucky bastard. The screams I heard were pretty loud. So uh, basically, so uh, we tried to clone Artemy for some reason. Why, why don't you just take Artemy? I don't know. You had like the power of a fucking nation. Then this guy just fucking ran off, came back, yoked someone's face. Shit. No, so here is the only place Shimra is named, like mentioned. Like Shimra is dealt, is sent out to deal with this guy. And it, that makes sense because Shimra seems to be an absolute machine of a fucking problem. If you know in the comments, if you can clarify, I, I will actually pin your comment if you're really good and I will heart it and I will reply and be like, hey, thank you fucking for participating. He beats off someone's face. I'm not gonna go into more details than that. Oh! Shapeshifter! What the fuck? We actually have a real shapeshifter. I cannot believe it. I cannot believe it. Oh, is it like... Is it like to honor all the dead people from the previous one? Now we're gonna see. What is that? What is that? Uh, uh, so yeah, this looks like every person has been possessed into this. Uh, I'm just gonna have to pause this and see it here. Uh, description. I'm not real. I'm not real. I'm not real. Okay, that, that was not real. I'm not real. Written by us. So this is like everyone that has been dead by the black enemy. Because as we can see, this guy is dead. Uh, it's like overbite or something. This guy, uh, the, the, the hink, uh, ho uh, the, the, that guy is dead. Uh, so the dead people come back to write something. Which is fucking disgusting. But I guess that's how we do it. Which means that this also sets up for the fucking third version to come out. Because, well, so far it's, it sets up. Because that means the dead person, dead guys can come back and have some sort of impact. But we're gonna see how this runs up. But this is just fucking... <laughs> Fuck yeah, okay. So that's all the dead people on the roll. The mother's face, it glows. Okay, let's see. Uh, the last guy is Splatty, my boy. I can't hear it. And just like me. Just like me. You're, your end. You're 
Ego M. I don't have ego, Splash. Why well, you tell me I have ego? I can't tell what they say because I'm like too focused right now. But if you have the lyrics, write them to me right now, baby boy. Let's see, Splash. What the fuck happened to you? Let's see, brother. <laughs> Looks like a king though. Not gonna lie. Dude, does, Splat, does anyone know if Splat actually has red hair in real life? That's my main mission in life to know if Splat has red hair. Splat face real? What? Hey, sorry, Miss Splat. Status infected. Stage five cancer. He escaped the radiation fast, so the blackening couldn't evolve. While looking for help in the woods, JT found him. Lama heard a commotion and tried to defend him, but to no avail. JT took care of Splat and then turned towards Lama. Lama couldn't defend himself well, but luckily, me and Anka were able to help him in time. I got a nasty scar too. Written by Seb. Where is Anka in this? Have we seen Anka? And that's all the lore. Uh, I would guess like this would be Anka, but that's Pixel, so I don't really know where Anka would be. So that's all the fucking lore. This feels like it could be set up for something else, but right now, uh, we actually have uh, some secret stuff that we're gonna do. Uh, so let's see it now. Uh, the terminal. If I can just. Victim oh! one. Alright, good. Lama's recorder works. Anyways, third test is in, uh, I'm pretty deep in the woods right now. I'm pretty fucking creepy. Shit, what's that? <laughs> Anyone? Holy fuck. Is that overbite? I, I gotta tell Sib. <laughs> oh fuck, I gotta get out of here. Is that Sep? What the fuck is in the fuck? What the fuck is in the fucking forest? Who was that? I think I have another one in my head. Let's see. Ah! There is nothing I have left to live for. Who even are these people? Why should I stick around to help them? The only person who cared. The only one who cared about me is gone. What's the point if the rest don't care? The rest couldn't give a fuck. All I am is a waste of resources. I'm done. I can't do this anymore. Goodbye. Documentation. was that uh, that all someone uh, they, they killed themselves because all other people kind of just went away i guess it has something to do with anka i feel like anka has something to do with this why did he kill himself though who is this guy who the fuck is this guy that killed himself no picture is this someone in the mod what the fuck what 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 did i do What happened? What the fuck? What the fuck happened? Fuck cap? You said yeah. This the, the picture changed. Uh, but wait, we have one more. Ooh, the final one. Uh, JT, I got Hopi. the message you sent. You gotta go out there with Jester on your own. I know what I'm doing, Hopi. I can take care of him and myself. I don't trust that. They're out there. They won't stop for you because you know what you're doing. I'll be fine. I won't be gone forever. Oh. I'll just try and help him out and see where he's coming from. So why don't you just let him stay at the camp? We don't have the materials for that. You're impossible to argue with. Stay safe, I guess. Where the fuck though? Now is my question. Where is Neister? He's just not in this. Where is Acerus? Why is Acerus not in this? Yeah, this, the, I believe this is just for, for the fucking codes. But, but you can look at it if you want to. This is what you can look at. <laughs> let's, oh fuck, let's make a beat. Holy shit, I almost forgot to make a beat. Let's make a beat now, okay?
Ladies and gentlemen, I want you to fucking have a good ass thank you for watching this video, okay? Uh, remember, if you have anything to say in the comments, uh, write it down and I can explain it a bit to me. And I want you to have a good ass time. Uh, remember to, you know, like and subscribe if you want more of this type of videos. See you next time. Wow!